This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Voldemar back here with another episode of Sacred 2. In the last episode, we continued to do more quests, and then we ran around with our chicken with our head cut off as we went around this whole thing before we figured out how to get in there when it was all just a like a slight little thing to the left, you know. To the left with behind the or to the right behind the bushes. Boom. That's how they did in Toy Story 2. That's how I'm doing it now. Then we defeat the Gar Colossus or whatever it is, and we're gonna get a reward and the next step in our journey. Because the broker told us to. You saved our lives. I am forever in your debt. From now on, I swear no harm will come to the girls in this region. You know, I've seen such a Gar Colossus once before, in a place near the Orchid territory. They call it the place where the magic flows from the earth. The Elven expedition was going that way when they left here. And one more thing. A strange man came to my door and asked that you visit the local academy. It's just north of here. You can't miss it. Strange man, North Academy. I'm Why not? To see that you have come there's to no, your there's no. Uh, for I guess he was saying that for the broker purposes or something. So, all right, let's uh. Oh, it seems like it's slowing down slower there. All right. Um. Uh, okay. So North, North Ho, Academy, strange person. Nothing wrong with that at all. Nothing bad. It's gonna. Everything's gonna go our way. Man, I'm so. By the end of this journey, the uh, seraphim's ca calves are going to be just ginormous. Like this, one. this place specifically? You have an interesting taste in things, Miss Seraphim. All right, let's uh, talk to our talk to our uh, mysterious benefactor or whatever. Uh, okay, come on, come on. Hello. There we go. Good job out there. Rescued the girls, knocked off Mudman, even turned the broker to the good side. Although, mind you, he'll still take some watching. I've heard of this place where the Gar Colossus came from. Raw pools of magic coming right up out of the ground. Breeds monsters of all sizes. It's where the young orcs go to prove they can fight. Rite of passage and all that. It's the one spot where you won't find them at each other's throats. They're too busy killing monsters instead. So you just distract them from uh, some other types of violence so they don't do it upon themselves. Oh, okay. Let's talk to them again because we need to? I what? heard rumors that there are other places like this so-called place where the magic flows from the earth. When I sent the expedition to support the Grurag clan in their struggle against the Orthag clan, I also asked them to find out if the rumors are true. I want you to do the same. Okie dokie, First Mr. Elves, academic then humans, dude. now orcs. This adventure just keeps getting wilder. What, just because it mentions humans, elves, and orcs, that means it's wilder? I don't know if that's really how that... Oh, well, we can either go to that unique mount or go on to the, on to the next step. Well, let's check out that mount thing. It might be, it might be worth trying to look into um, actually getting a... Uh, um, a mount or something like that. Maybe I wonder how it works. Do you just summon the mount or? Okay, I, I went the completely wrong way. Come on. Okay, did I? Okay, this. This. Okay, that gets me out of there. No, okay. This way. Well, this one's just a quest close by. I thought I'd check that out, but then I'm going to head towards that unique mount and see if we can get him out for... Maybe it's free or something like that. Who knows? All right, kill some, kill some local goblin bandits. What do they look like up close? They look like just like small... small. They do look like small orcs. Uh-oh, back to the epic music. You cannot handle the epic music, goblins. You will die. I don't know why I'm fighting it now. Just... Well, it's because there was like a quest line nearby, and I was like, okay, let me finish them off so they don't. I don't know, just beat the quest giver or something. Oh, wait, is this just for Goblin Blades? Oh, it is just for Goblin Blades. Or, okay. Work Sportsman Heart. I don't remember a mission where I have to get a heart. Huh. That's interesting. Alright. Well, I mean, we'll. 
if we get enough goblin blades while we're running towards the next destination, I don't really see an issue with that. Stand still. I'm gonna stand still so I can cut you some more. I shall taunt you a second time. Looks like this is all just for. Okay, I'll just uh, go towards that. I'll just fight them on the way there, you know, that type of thing. So. Come on, I was about to. Trying to get that uh I'm trying to get that one ability that one. Well you know I off screen I completely forgot to uh um, level myself up. Or I mean get my skills up because of the levels. You are you afraid? You will be. You will be. Alright, calm down, Seraphim. I know you're I know you got a bloodlust going on right now, but you know, calm, calm your pits. Calm your big, massive seraphim and angelic tits over there. No, I'm just. I'm just I don't even know if they're that huge. I assume they're huge because they're, uh. They're, um. Because it's a fantasy, and most. What, book 3 The Poisons of Ancaria, Their Use, Effects, and Attributes. What? Alright. Okay, I am heading towards the. Did I not attack them? Oh, I guess where I haggled. I, I guess where I toggled it. Okay, I'll just go leave these boars alone. And I, I finished that goblin sword quest, so I'll get that on the way back. Cause I'll tell, I'll just teleport back to the town, and then head towards that gate so we can go to orc territory. I thought we were supposed to go to orc territory earlier, but maybe it was just more of a mentioning that that where we're going is close to it or something. I feel like I keep missing snippets of the story, even though it's being told to me right in my face. Like, like I'm not invested enough to uh, to pay attention or something. I'm usually pretty generally uh, good at paying attention for the most part, uh, but I don't know. Like I guess I guess it depends on the mood I'm in. I guess. I guess you can say that with anyone, really. All right, I'm not fighting five, fifty, twenty goblins at once. Yeah. Y'all can go soak your heads for all I care. All right, not much farther. It's like they're slowly backing off. Do not back off. I will kill you. No, I'd rather you back off so I don't, I don't, so I don't have to bother with you people. All right, so this is another little Earth Axe Moxie. It's like another little Berg. You're the blacksmith, right? Like Can you those actually do small anything villages for me? where people peacefully see to their business, yeah. unaware of the larger world's turmoil. All the all the equipment I have can't be slotted, so never mind. All right, we we're gonna talk to a guy about a about a mount or something like that. What type of mount? Don't answer that. Sounds oh, it's outside. I'm Sounds sure too the gross to folk gross in this village consider. here need my help. Well, maybe not everyone needs your help, Seraphim. Frustrated archaeologist, bring me back my lost map. Oh, man, that would have been the discovery. Mounts, really dangerous mounts, bred by a mystic order on Mount Island. That's Mount Island? Really? Okay, whatever. That's where you can find them. Where did I leave that busted map? It must be around here somewhere. I'll tell you something. I don't even want, to, I don't even want that map anymore. Go and look for it if you like. I'll show you how to this read task it. Will be completed okay, quickly. so we got to get this map to... To get to Mount Island? How do you get to Mount... Is that Mount Island over there or something? Am I... Or... I don't know. Now yeah, let's just... Uh, if we didn't do the side quest, we wouldn't have gotten to this town. Who did, Who know... Who would have known that what where this place would take us to? Captain Tilrog. Take the order to my men at the Watchtower. I recently sent a few men to the Watchtower. I have now learned that the way there is overrun with goblins. It was very important that the men concentrate entirely on the upcoming... Thar... The Raconian attack. I want to be informed as soon as the Raconians are here. I have a written order to hold the front for it at all costs. Could you deliver this order? Trust sure. In the gods and my Will strength. we do it right now? I don't know. Oh. You guys have red marks on you. Shouldn't you be attacking me or something? Okay. I will. Wait, now you're going to attack me? Oh, now you're going to attack me. Okay. Why were you not attacking me? Alright, what's that? Resistance is futile. Exterminate! 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 Alright, come on. Okay, isn't that tough? There we go. You cannot beat me with your spear and, Vi and super Viking helmet. 
I think that's... Or Mighty Helmet, sorry. I will beat you with my sword and Mighty Helmet. Yo, what? My spear and Mighty Helmet. Yo, what? My Mighty Helmet. Or whatever. I haven't seen, I haven't seen that cartoon in so long, I don't remember if, you, if I'm even saying it correctly. Alright, we just keep going. I guess we have done a few episodes of the plot, so it wouldn't be too bad to do some side quests again. Yeah, I try to I try to do a little bit of both. Usually if it's on the way, but the only reason I'm doing this is because I want to see about how mounts are being um, handled or or if I get one at the end of it. Okay, so if I we said he'd tell me to read it, but now the quest is telling me to go over here. Or is this a different type of quest? Okay, and you guys are being attacked by goblins. Oh, there we go. Yeah, get out of here. Go on. Get on. Get out of here. There you go. Alright, let's see what these folks have. Or what information they can give me. Guard Bilter. Tilgon sent you? Oh, an order from the old guy Pustin. Let's see. Yeah, right. It's as if we're going to take off and start hunting goblins. Well, thanks for bringing us this extremely important document. It is finished. Huh. Do I hear some uh, sarcasm in your voice? Katharina Zeiss. When you're at the Lizard's Men's, you really should take a look at the Swamp Belly Toads. Very interesting creatures. Okay. Oh, what quest uh, involved for giving them that? Slay some goblins. <laughs> yeah, so they don't want to slay the goblins. They're going to tell me to slay the goblins. We have orders to guard the mouth of the river. It's a little difficult, perhaps. Uh, however, because we keep getting attacked by goblins. Would you do us a little favor and slay some of those pests? We'd be rewarded for your efforts. The gods and my All right. strength. I don't want to trust in any gods, especially not the giant flying spaghetti monster. That son of a bitch has been telling me lies my whole life. Oh, oh, oh it's just another kill things quest. Uh, I think he did say kill like. Alright, come on, let's get this over with. We're, we're in the area, might as well, might as well get it done. Get her done. I was like they're all, since they're all getting out, maybe this will make it a bit easier. There. Yeah, that's, that'll work. Where's an ogre when you need yeah, it? Yeah, I might finish this pretty quick. Ogre? These are goblins have to control ogres or something like that? I guess. Alright. Ah, right, get back here. Whoa! No! Get over here, you. Yeah. Alright, last one. Right? There we go. Alright. Well, they were just, you guys could have just hop skipped and jumped out of your little your little tower there and killed all those goblins, but uh, if you want to waste all that money on a simple task, I guess that's why people hire uh, labor workers because they don't want to do the work themselves. Alright, give me give me your reward. Thanks, you had our backs with that move. Th with that move? What? What does that, what does that even mean? Yeah. Uh, eliminate both of the Cronian scouts, but isn't that your job? Over there, on that knoll, did you see them? A few of them are holed up in there. We have to get rid of them. If they're gathering too much information about our position and our forces, they can jeopardize our situation. We need to keep a low profile. Would you take on this task and eliminate the scouts? I'll be glad to help. Sure, but I think I might come back and do that later. Oh, it's right there. Alright, we'll do it. Yeah. I, was, I was thinking about just not doing it, but it's like, it's not that far away, so... And we could always use more experience, and we're almost at level 13. I always want to have just enough levels so I don't have to do too much later on. Alright, can I just get over there, or do I have to go some, like, convoluted way around? Well, it's like some convoluted way around. Oh, can we actually... Oh, 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 we can actually get over there with no problem. Alright, let's take these guys out. You will not get away from me. Try to do some buffing. Ah, nice. Level up. So, uh, I'll do, uh, mess with that later. I keep forgetting to do that, though. I don't know why. Leveling up is important. You get new skills or, or boot bumps or whatever, but I keep forgetting to, uh, you know, mess with it. Alright, let's talk to these guys. Ha! Huh, do the soldiers of the barony not have the guts to battle anymore? So send a clown like you out instead? Send in the clowns. Those laughing daffy clowns, those hopeful and woeful schmotes by the bowlful clowns. Except this is a seraphim with a sword, so not a 
Hooray. We did it. Alright, got some experience in gold. And whatever else the uh whatever else they give you. Alright, I'm gonna skip you guys. Hope you don't chase me. You're chasing me. Great. You know, at some point you guys stop giving me worthwhile experience. You gotta remember that game. Just keep that in mind. Anyway, let's get a reward. Let me guess, is he gonna give us another quest after we get get the reward for that? Thank you. That was an impressive demonstration of your abilities. Here, take this. This mission has been Oh good, another quest. Great. Alright, what do you got? Give the beggar this food parcel. Will you look at that? That beggar stole all the offerings from the altar again. He's obviously found a new food source. I know it isn't easy to be a beggar in this day and age, but on the other hand, you can't make off with the offerings for the gods. Here, take him this food parcel and tell him that in the future you should stay away from the offerings. I'll be glad to help. Otherwise, we'll skin him alive. Now, how does he feel about that nonsense? Alright, do we have to go down? Let's like we have to go down, yeah. Alright, gonna have to run through all those goblins probably again. That's fine. Murder them in their whole can. It'll be a happy day. Kalu Kale. Yeah, look at all this. Like I said, I really wish I had magic so I could just blast them with a fireball. Actually, does it, do any of the characters actually have a fireball spell or? I don't know, I haven't actually played any of the other characters. You can make multiple characters for the file and swap them out if you need to, but I'd rather just stick with the, the, the story-based character and go from there. I, I guess technically they're all story-based, but you know what I mean. What? For me? Oh, how generous of you! Of course I won't touch the offerings anymore. I'm gonna rest a bit and move on. I hope you have a nice day! Alright. Oh, is that it for the quest? Okay, we'll just teleport. Come on. Our highlights. Oh, I forgot to. Uh, I didn't actually. Oh, man, I didn't activate it. That's, all right, I have to run all the way back there. I think the reason I didn't activate it is I wanted to teleport back to this town because this town didn't have a gate for some reason. So, no. Nope. You would think every at least town would have a have a gate for quick uh, for quick t transport, but uh, no, I guess not. Uh, this game has a lot of weird inconveniences. Does it make it a bad game? No, but it seems like for how interesting it is running around from one town to the next, it's, I mean, it's there just to get money and experience from killing those things. I don't know. You can only make you can only make running around a large map interesting for so long, really, before any open world game is uh, gets boring. You know, even even games that are generally popular, at least at the time, can can get. I've noticed most open world games, especially modern ones, aren't very well done when it comes to open world. Like a lot of them, just fill it with a ton of crap, but not a lot of good crap. If that makes sense. well, I mean, crap is crap. I mean, good stuff. You know, they always fill it with crap, thinking, oh, if there's a ton of content, obviously it means it's good. Not really. I'd rather have two hours of awesomeness than ten hours of of wandering around and boringness. Frustrated archaeologist. So, you really did find it. Where was it? Well, it doesn't matter. Here's how you read it. Now, all that's left for you to go is find a captain who can take you there. It's done. So, I have to find someone to take me there? Do I have to go? Oh. Oh. Huh. How do you get there? There's probably like a... All it does is tell me where I'm supposed to go, but... Wait, I can teleport there? Really? Maybe that's a glitch. I don't know. Let's find out. Huh. Well, we'll see what happens. Hopefully it doesn't... Hopefully my game doesn't get destroyed or whatever. Oh, it just let me teleport there. Huh. You would think it let me... I'd have to go to... Talk to the cat to initiate a sea journey. A sea journey? Or well, we're on the island. Misfit toys? No, probably misfit heroes or pirates. Yarr. I already miss talk like a pirate day, so. Oh well. I always miss that day. I always keep saying, "Oh, I'm gonna go to work and do pirate talk all day," because it'll annoy the crap out of my, out of uh, out of everyone I work with. But uh, no, nah, I forgot about it. Oh well. All right, dude. I need to go to the island of misfit mascots. Can you take me there? Oh, you're a big fella. 
Are you a goblin or an orc? Or a goblin? Are you an orc or something? Or ogre? Huggard, prove your fighting strength. I, I good. God mounts here. Big job. When you got gold, my mount. Very good. Fighter mounts. You show can fight now. Bad things there. No good. You kill. You come back with you. Wait, when I'm dead? Well, then you, well, I'll be dead. <laughs> You'll explode. Um, all right. Alright, so we're gonna deal with these fighting mounts or something like that. Like fighting food odds or God, I can't remember I remember that. That was a weird cartoon. Not very good not very good at uh, Yeah, I would say it's not very good. It was trying to be a Pokemon clone, basically. Fighting food taunt here, there, and everywhere. Fighting food on something something. I don't remember the whole song. I don't remember if it's a piece of it's not really it wasn't that memorable. But yeah, I think it was supposed to be, it was trying to be like a uh, Pokemon clone. Pokemon had been very big at the time, so a lot of shows were trying to, uh... How do you get down there? I must be missing like a, like a ramp or something like that. Let me keep looking around, maybe there's a... Well, no, that takes me out to the sea, so that's obviously not the right direction. There's gotta be like somewhere nearby here that takes me down there. Hmm. What does that one say? It probably tells you the directions. Wind Serpent. What does that mean? Who knows? Okay. Huh? I don't know how to get down there. Okay, I just... I can't just drop. Okay, clearly... I look... Okay, I'm looking, but it, I don't see uh, how to get down there. Am I going... Well, no, now it says to go back this way. What the hell? I don't care. I feel like... the. The, the the place where once we go keeps moving on me with that with that sticking. All right. <sighs> well, all right. Well, let's, uh, we'll uh, I think we'll call it there. All right. So in the next episode of Sacred Two, we're gonna deal with these fighting fighting mounts and get one of our own. So maybe we can get from point A to point B a little bit quicker and have a little bit of extra defense against the baddies of the world. So join us next time as we figure that out. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time.